Hey guys, welcome back to my Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough. In the last part, I finally did another main story mission. Micah is still not free, but I'm also not really worried about him. I feel like nobody's missing him. Last time anyone's talked about him was like in episode 2, and we're at episode 7 right now, I think. So yeah, I'm kind of enjoying the current situation without him, but we did free Sean in the previous episode, and then we had this whole huge camp party it was really wholesome we sit up all night and drank danced with mary beth sat by the fire talked to the gang it was just such a good time i feel like this is my favorite moment of this game so far we then robbed a homestead with javier which got us a lot of money i really did not expect to get this much money out of this seemingly small mission and then i was just riding through the world on my horse and out of nowhere Javier appeared and was like hey go with me Bill's in trouble we gotta save him so we did we freed the guy and that is where we stopped at I don't have any actual plans for today's episode but I think we're gonna be starting with the main story mission with Hosea and then we'll just see what else we'll be doing before we get started i want to give a huge thank you to my channel members thank you guys so much for joining me for today's episode let's get into it oh, oh, oh. are you okay oh, oh, oh jesus please i can't i can't take this pain I'm all slashed. I'm, uh, I'm burning up. Got some medicine. Better than nothing. Whiskey? Damn it, that won't help. Look at me. I'm bleeding out here. Well, what else do you want me to do, man? Can't. Can't. Stay. I can't hold. I get her. Whoa. Okay, um, looting him would probably be pretty bad, but maybe I'm supposed to loot him? Salt of beef. Well, now I feel bad. Good opossum pelt! There we go. Now, now that was worth it. There's a dead wolf somewhere down there. Oh no! Wait! Ugh. Thank God that isn't mine. Okay, girl. Yeah. What is easy, this? Easy. We're starting off pretty well. I really wanted to save, dude. But I feel like whiskey would have probably not helped either. Can't carry any more of this item. Premium cigarettes. Okay. Well, I know what we're gonna do now. Um, discard all. There you go. Now we can take it. Large jewelry bag. Wow. Nice. Miracle tonic. Okay, I see. So that was worth it. around nose in the air holding hands with that dumb come on kid i think he just got his heart broken hey you care about this girl stand up for yourself she'll come around yeah i've been waiting Trust me, kid. There ain't so many good men out there. Make yourself one of the good ones. Thanks, mister. I hope you're right. Oh. That's sweet. I wonder if Arthur considers himself a good man. Probably not, right? Someday, I'll show you. You'll show him. Rich. A nice big house. Mm. The old 
will be begging me to court you. Can't talk to him anymore. Oh boy. Bowie Meg. <laughs> oh boy. Maybe I'll just stay here forever. Yeah. Away like some fallen leaf. Crinkle just... up. Wouldn't that be Easy. nice? Whoa. Just keep talking. Self-loathing. Yeah. That ain't gonna get you far. Wait. No, he's gonna go now. <laughs> so up now. Nice, dude. Maybe we save the guy from drowning himself or something. Oh. Yeah. Whoa, 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 what is going on? Okay there. You there. Would you be interested in some friendly competition? Sure. I've come all the way north from Mexico to challenge a real American gunslinger. You him? Sure. Me? A real gunslinger? <laughs> Let's find out. Okay, man. That's what I like to hear. Look, man, rules are simple, okay? Whoever shoots more of these bottles, wins. Just draw your gun and aim when you're ready, all right? <laughs> okay. Shoot! Whoa. Perfecto. Damn it all! How the hell did you beat me, huh? You didn't well, even try. Better shot, I suppose. Ah, oh, that didn't make me happy at all. How about we raise the stakes, huh? And then right, do let's what? Let's do it. Aha! Uh -huh, that's a good call, amigo. Okay, whoever shoots four birds out of the sky first wins. Simple enough. Stand near me, and as soon as they come out, it's anyone's shot. Be patient. Ah, there they go. Shoot! Oh, dude. Ah, <laughs> It was a good try, but <laughs> maybe next time, huh? Listen, you need to pay me for your loss, okay? Should we raise the sacks? I ain't giving you shit. Okay, give me what you owe me, cowboy. Now that's the real challenge here. Who's a better gunslinger? Know what I'm saying? Ten dollars. Yeah, there we go. My Arthur's a good boy, okay? See? Look. Look at my reputation. My Arthur's a good boy, okay? Before you say anything. Hey there, girl. I'm allowed to do some silly things sometimes. Yeah. And nobody's seeing that. What is this? My controller just vibrated. So I'm assuming there's something in here. Structure inspect. Oil Derrick. He's just drawing random stuff. Okay, wait. We haven't looked at the journal in quite some time. Panfaka Hernandez for that silly book. Killed him. Bastard jumped out of the way, but I still got him. Didn't seem like the type I was going to be friend anyway. Hmm. 
Met a nice fella taking photos of animals. Albert Mason, I think it was called. Kind and interesting and entirely lost and unused. It's a real country, even though he seemed to love it. Trying to take pictures of all our biggest predators before they all got killed off themselves by the modern world. Should have got him to take a picture of Dutch. <laughs> he got dropped by a coyote, but I got him his bait back. Got into some god awful fight in the town saloon. Bill started it. Wait a second. We haven't read that yet, but this is like a very long time ago so how come this was only added now he's bound so tight about something i reckon he'll start hitting himself soon enough i was stopped from beating some big yokel to death by a local do-gooder i could not tell if this made me pleased or real angry the local crowd seemed to want to see blood however afterwards dutch accosted me with old josiah trelawney back and quiet as slippery and confusing as ever this was a long time ago but it's only now in journal He'll come and go, no doubt, and leave none us any the wiser as to who or what he is. Trelawney told us that Sean had not been killed in Blackwater, but was a prisoner there, held by scalp hunters awaiting payment. Charles Smith, Javier and I met in Blackwater and rescued that loud mouth maniac before we'd even cut him free from the tree he was mouthing off at us. Javier said Blackwater is an impossible situation and I guess I had better forget about all that money. All them years wasted earning that stuff. Guess I'll never quite know what happened, but the upshot is we're on the run and known to more folks in authority than we would like. Well, I hope someday we can return to Blackwater and not have to fear for our lives constantly. Met an idiot hunting for treasure, bought a map off him. What are if I'll find anything? This fella I took to talking with at the train station told me that I could get this money if I collected complete sets of cigarette cards and sent them to him. We shall see. Sounds harmless enough. And that's it. We're done. Oil Derek. So what is this? And what's so special about this place? Whoa. Okay. Whoa. I see. So something real bad happened here. We can loot him. Probably not a good idea, but maybe he has a map or something. Letter from Cornwall, Kerosene, and Tar. It's full of blood. Dear Mr. Var Barley, it is very regrettable that you have rejected the various extremely generous purchase offers presented to you by Cornwall, Kerosene, and Tar. Mr. Cornwall has obligingly consented to allowing you a grace period of a further three weeks to reconsider your position and we strongly advise you to do so after that i would be very concerned about a company of your size being able to continue to compete on price in this state of new hanover and to secure acceptable rates for railroad transportation we look forward to hearing from you soon and as always wish you the best of good fortune in all your endeavors yours faithfully they killed him right he freaking murdered him, right? Oh boy. Okay. I kind of don't want to go down there. But why not? A dinosaur bone! Hell yeah! Nice. We found one. You have discovered the location of a dinosaur bone. You can mail the coordinates to Deborah McGuinness from any post office. Nice. I was wondering how we were going to find them. Here we are. It's funny because I think from a gameplay point of view, we're only now supposed to enter this little town. But we've already been here because of this one lady who needed a right because her horse died. So now we're just gonna An find. Interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no Let's doubt. Say. I do interesting very well. It's trusting I don't do so well. Please. I remember this guy. I, to work with good people, Seamus, I did I not like right him. Well, they all say that. I never met an idiot that called himself one. Arthur. This is Seamus. 
He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? To this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his <laughs> boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that, and then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So he Whoa. wants to take out your competition. Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin by marriage. I also what? want to see if you boys got what it takes. I now, you survive that. Where is he? Well, he's a in a farmhouse just marriage. northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. By marriage? Oh, yes, I love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. What the By fuck marriage. Is a cousin? By marriage. Ugh. I love the dynamic between Hosea and Arthur, by the way. It's like a father son thingy they've got going on. It's so cute. Really? Really. Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? You're the one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. Oh, clearly you've recovered from your bear encounter. Okay, so he told us... Could have played that better, couldn't you? Thought you wanted me here to show some strong. Ah. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Look where you're going. Come on, Hosea. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches, that's easy money for us. And he told I us he's got some right. money. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus's old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. <laughs> So what's the story with that Emerald Ranch? You find out anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Seamus is sure scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange about the place. Used to be a saloon there, general store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. Sounds worth a look around. Yeah. For sure. Seamus also mentioned the rancher's daughter a couple of times. Right, remember oh, what the lady said? used to see her around all the time, but now she never leaves the house. Probably just sweet on her. That what you call finding out a little? Once he opens up, seems Seamus does like to talk. That's a good thing. Hopefully not too much. Wait, that, yeah, that's a bad thing. For us. But it can also be a good thing if he keeps talking about other people. I was able to talk to him about something else. Easy. But not now. No go. Yep. So how far away is this? We're almost there. Cousin by marriage. That must Just be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. Incredibly weird. Yep, yep. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. Oh boy. Horse balls. Don't worry, I saw them. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Oh, okay. 
So we go first to the house and then... Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. Nope. There we go. Anyone around? Yes. Okay. I reckon we can do it now. I'll head over, oh, I distract see. him by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Uh, let's go with night. Let's wait. I feel like robberies work a bit better at night, right? Okay, let's go. Sure. You go into the house. I'll go find this wagon. Okay. Maybe take a peek through the windows before you go in. Make sure it's all quiet. I'm hearing something. Is that someone snoring or? Maybe a different entry. How about that? Shut up, Arthur. Security card, I'll take that. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Chimney. Is there something there? So bad. Kind of want to go in here. Damn it. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Maybe I'm being a bit too greedy here. above the chest lock onto the chest bro I don't want to wake the guy what is going on Money clip. That's not a lot of money. That's that's more like it. Uh, 
Anything by the chimney? No. Oh, shit. Oh, Lord. necklace how did i miss this whole chest things we got two hundred dollars let's fucking go that went smooth holy Come shit on. get on and let's head back that was worth it that is so much money we just made over two hundred dollars. Horse, you follow me, please. Can I not talk to us there? Nicely done. We got everything we needed. And I'm pretty sure they never even knew I was there. Yes, we. Less problems, the better, right now. Just need to get this back to Seamus in one piece, and it's a good night's work. So what were you able to lift from the house? Found some money, stashed away. Must be a few hundred, not too bad. Not bad at all. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. I'm looking forward to your retelling of that one around the campfire. Bro. Move out of the way. It wasn't the first time Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye. And as usual, he did not flinch. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. How long you think we're gonna stick around here for? Not sure. Until we can't, I suppose. Feels like we're starting to get back on our feet. Slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long way from being full. I hope it's not stashed in town like we did in Blackwood. <laughs> Even if we had to dump the money from the ferry, we could have at least got the rest out if it was hidden someplace else. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. Yep. I wanted to let him talk, but it was too late already. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. By mm. marriage. Park that thing in here. Quickly. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. Ooh. But discreet, you know. Of course. Always. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Sure. sure. How much money was that? Like, he just gave Hosea a bit more money. We just made so much money. could have stayed in town and take a look at what exactly is going on there because something's fishy in that town right but whatever i feel like it's nice to get back to camp and see the gang from time to time the spines of america wait Bronze, what could I have done differently? To prove their business credentials to the Emerald Ranch fence, Seamus, Arthur, and Hosea attempt to rob a stagecoach from Old Bob Crawford at Carmody Dell. Loot everything from Carmody Dell. No. Oh, I guess maybe because my pockets were already full. That probably counts, right? 
Damn it, was there something else? Like another chimney or something that I missed? Arthur's cut. Ugh, I always forget the gang savings cut. And then Hosea also got his money. Damn it, we got $300. You can now sell stolen weapons to Seamus at the wagon fence in Emerald Ranch. Oh, okay. In addition to buying stolen wagons, Seamus runs a fence. Visit a fence to sell valuables, buy illicit goods or craft talismans and trinkets. I don't believe for one minute that you ever made it to Australia. Everything okay, Miss Grimshaw? Yeah, you'd be right. Yes, I finally did. about done cleaning up but after that party. <laughs> as far as Chicago, Chicago ain't nowhere near Australia. No, but it's on the way. I always want to see one of them kangaroos. Giant bucks and rats who <laughs> keep their babies in their pockets. That's pretty sick, right? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of lunatic thought that up? <laughs> That's an interesting way of seeing things. Maybe we'll head over there one of these days, huh? Yeah. Start a new life as kangaroo farmers. <laughs> He'd be the first one to get knocked out by well, kangaroo. Well, there's a dream we ain't had yet. <laughs> Are you drunk again? You've got to be kidding me. He's gonna drink himself to hey. death. Mr. Morgan. Come on. Give me that again. Didn't we just do this? I'm only joking with you. I'm not. I went in that to stop drinking. Necessary? Well, I should get back to it. Somebody. Yeah, got it, Mr. Morgan. Somebody needs to help this dude. You hey, and Karen. Sean seem to enjoy the party then? Oh, shut up. What did I say? All right, well, I should be getting on. Y'all would All never right, guess what I saw Karen and Sean Mr. doing Pearson? in the back when I was sitting at. I don't remember which table it was, but I was sitting there with Bill and John, I think. And then the back, I could see this tent right there, I think. And Sean and Karen got out of there together. I did notice while playing, but while editing, I was like, What? Was not again, dude. No, I don't have the oh, patience. Not again. No, not today. Not today, man. Like the waves of the bay of the biscuit. I began to tumble and roar. Are you done? Because I'd like to My eat. My face was as red <laughs> as a lobster. I fell and broke my poor knobster. I watched she was picked Boy. from my fob, sir. I like to punch I'll him. I'll never get drunk no more. Bro, he keeps following me around. Go. I'm resolved to try it. <laughs> Holy shit. I'll get you a moderate diet. I'll drink He's not gonna survive this game, right? I'm just wondering when it's gonna happen. Holy shit. Let's take a look at the ledger. Actually, let's contribute. Give money. Oh, right. Um. We have $900 right now. I'd like to donate like 250 maybe. There we go. Whoa. I just got an achievement. Um. Right, ledger. And now let's buy something. 
That's gonna help us. Mind if I warm myself here a minute, gentlemen? How you boys keep it? Charles Swagen. Well, I reckon we're on the turn now. Improve Our offense. Turn and we're going to be fine. Dutch is lodging. Right. Encourages others to donate. Never doubted him for a minute. <laughs> Sad business when Davy passed. Sad business when anyone passes, but we're going to make it. Dutch will see okay, us. Okay, Susan. Right yeah. Of course she I actually will. want to get this. Exactly, Mr. Williamson. Other camp members have been inspired yes. to contribute He's more. The ideal. The American this country was set up to create. There yes. you go, Dutch. Excuse me. Good night, gentlemen. Arthur wants a map to help fund journeys. Whoa. Upgrade Arthur's lodging unlocks the fast travel map, allowing you to quickly travel to previously discovered locations. Whoa, how much is that? 260. There we go. Ledger. There we go. Next in line. Your lodging has been upgraded. A fast travel map and additional grooming supplies are now available. You can now also fast travel from your personal camp. That's nice. It's of a flash packet. A packet I've seen. Goodbye, farewell. Goodbye, farewell. She's a hardy flash packet. The dreadnought's her name. Hurrah, me boys. Whoa, Bill. <laughs> I thought that was a corpse. We got new grooming options. Trim. All facial hair. You know what? Arthur really does need that. No, I, I cannot commit to this. I cannot. Like, it's not bad, okay? But if he already has the facial hair... I'd like to keep it. No! No! I didn't want to... Alright, Arthur. You're gonna wear your hat for a while now. It seems like we don't have anything else to do, really, except for Micah. We also have this. Albert Mason. Albert Mason needs some further help with his wildlife photography. Sure, let's go ahead and do that. And maybe we're gonna free Micah afterwards. Damn it. Only because it's like really near him. Wait. Good morning, Arthur. I see something here. What's that? Charles, go hunting. What you prepare sure. for? Let's go. Let's even better. Gifts. An unguarded stagecoach. <laughs> no, you simple minded fool. Bison. Bison? Bison. I already hunted you can get one. anything. There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Right? Good luck. You want to come with me? Yeah. I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? Mount up there. Well, then let me untack this quickly. Let's go. My plans in this game just never work out. But I'm perfectly fine with that. Let's go, girl. You know, it was before my time, of course, but my mother used to tell me stories of how her tribe moved with the bison. They lived almost as one. The bison went, my people went. And they were the center of all life. We couldn't survive without them. They provided us with everything. Food, clothing, shelter, tools. There was a lot of respect. Huh. I don't remember much of my childhood. But I think my people, well, we pretty much moved with the whiskey. <laughs> well, you still my do. father did that too. Let's try over here, to the left. Oh, 
Over there. Ooh. You see them all? Incredible, aren't they? We should only kill one of them. I'll keep them ringed in and you see if you can bring one down. Okay? Clean as you can. Okay. Clean as I can. I just looked in the companion. Yeah. What kind of weapon we need for them? And it's like a rifle I don't have and improved arrows. How many stars they have? Anyways, let's get going. I I'm gonna get somewhere here. Oh, brother. Dead yet? Oh, I'm sorry. Fuck. Well done. I can't see how many stars he has. All right. Usually it's it. visible. Take the horns too. It can all be used. Oh no. I'm sorry. Good job. Stow that on your horse and mount up. Poor. I buy some help. I'll check something out. He wants to go check something out? Okay, let's go. Where are we going? I thought I saw some scavenger birds over here. Just wanted to see what attracted them. These ones? Oh, no. Look. Bison. Shot and left for dead, it looks like. Why would someone do that? I don't know. But I see tracks heading in this direction. Uh-oh. I say we follow them. All right. Lead the way. Been dead a couple of days, at least. Oof. Yeah, we're gonna show them. I might have slightly tortured the bison on my back. Could it have been an animal? Right now, no, but... they've been shot. I just don't know why anybody would just leave them here to rot like that. Yeah, that's just wrong. Look, another dead bison. On the hill to the right. Come on. Whoa. I think he just dropped. Shot and left for dead again. But this one looks fresher. Yeah, like There's a, a second ago. There. I'm gonna take a look. Ah. You find anything, Arthur? Well, did you? Arthur? Dogs haven't gone cold yet. Maybe half a day since they left. Bison's been dead about the same amount of time. So what do you want to do? They could still be in the area. Let's get up higher. See if we spot anything. What a damn waste. This way. We should have a good view from up here. I mean, no matter how bad the pelt is. Okay. You see anything? We at least got the meat and the horns. Arthur, look. Smoke to the north. Could be another camp. Let's go check it out.
killing for fun. You think we can talk? I don't kill for fun. I kill when I need to. Did we need to kill the bison? I'm not that sure. Look, more dead bison. It has oh, to shit. be that. Come on, wait up. Let's try to talk first. Did you fools shoot those bison? What's your problem? I said, did you fools shoot those bison? <laughs> Calm down, you black or red bastard, whatever the fuck you are. Bitch. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What? We. <laughs> it's that business of mine! Good God, you're crazy! I got a family. A family. Don't shoot me. Stand back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. Oh, yeah. What the hell are you doing? Why are we <laughs> killing those bison and leaving them to rot? I don't know what you're talking about. You just admitted God it. Damn it, tell us and you're dead. Oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as we could. And make it look like it was Indians. Just kill him, Arthur. No. Please, don't kill me. I'm begging you. That would also be wrong. Kill him. All right. I'll get out of here. <gasps> Just don't, don't shoot me, mister. I got a family. I'm not going to shoot you, but I... Run away. Can Why did you do that? He didn't need to die. Maybe he'll go tell his friends now what happens to poachers. Yeah. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. Okay. I'm gonna see if there's anything worth taking from there. Oh, the I'll hat. catch up with you later. Oh boy. I think that was the right decision, especially since they were paid for it. So now he can go back and tell them what happened. So maybe others won't do the same thing. A horse reviver. We have too many horse revivers. He's got another hat. A back hat. Oh shit. A lockbox. A letter? Poison throwing knife. In close combat altercations with wildlife, the hunter can often become the hunted if an animal is not dispatched quickly. Throwing a knife at an animal works, however, it may result in the loss of a very good knife if the animal flees while it remains buried in their hide. This recipe will help drop an animal in a matter of seconds. I see. Well, thank you. Old Dodge's chain, Sally! Run him down! What do y'all want from me? What was supposed to happen? But my horse is doing good and my health is also good. Who's there? Leave me alone. What are you Arthur! Doing Welcome That's back. It's me. Did the little kid throw a rock at? Kieran? Hi there, Arthur. Hey, Pearson. 
Let's donate. This stew is decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. Good. We really needed this. There we go. That's all. I don't think I, I want to get anything Mr. else. <laughs> Whoa. We just killed Easy. something on accident. Hey, bunny. <laughs> Yo! Not in the butthole! Arthur, what the fuck? Got no words for this. Pick him up, poor guy. Unbelievable. I love randomly riding through this world and just kicking animals with my horse. We already opened that thing. Right. Yeah. Oh okay. shit. Oh fuck. We all know what this is. Oh no. Sure, I'll take that. Where does this lead? Do you see? Yep, sadly I see. Ugh. We found the second one. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> this is some sick tran. <sighs> you find? Killer clue. These two. Awesome. What's coming from there? It's a westerly, so or is it an easterly? We're fine. We're fine. Hello again. Hello. <laughs> oh, hello. How are you, sir? Ah, uh, Morgan, Mr. Morgan. I'm sorry, my my nerves. I'm not quite the outdoor adventurer I thought. This is God's own country, and I feel I'm in purgatory. I know the feeling. No, oh, I hope not. What you trying to take some pictures of, huh? Some more greedy coyotes? No. Wolves. Wolves? Now you really are trying to get yourself eaten. Yep. Oh, I hope not. I left the meat over there. I thought I'd be safe. Given the wind. Yeah, sure. You managed to attract the world's least intelligent wolf. <laughs> well, I, I... I'll stay with you a while. If anything comes, I'll protect you as needed. You are a gentleman. Now, you don't know me very well. Well, to me, you're a gentleman. Usually, I'm worse than the wolves. You had many dealings with wolves, Mr. Morgan? Sure. But you've never been eaten. Not through lack of trying on their part. I mean, apparently. A while back, I helped a friend from getting devoured. Usually, they are not great fans of man. Don't blame them. Me neither. Hey, shh. There's one. Looks like we got company. Can you keep your head down while I take the shot? Yes, yes, there they are. In the trees. There's now, two, actually. Don't do anything. I'm going to take a few photographs. Come on. Come on. Oh, brother. He's calling his friends. Good boys. Hungry boys. Come on. That is the dumbest idea. Stay back, stay back. 
Can't have a man in the frame. They'd think it's staged. Yeah, sort of is. Magnificent creatures. Especially when clawing at your eyeballs. Come on. You provoked them, Mr. Morgan. Help! I provoked them? Help. Flashed before my eyes. Yeah, they can be pretty aggressive. Oh, what a way to literally a dog's dinner. His face. Still worse things happen at sea. Do they? <laughs> well, I imagine. Perhaps wolves do better at sea. Are they good swimmers? Well, who knows? You have saved my poor foolish skin once again. Don't mention it. Well, I can't begin to repay my debt of gratitude. But no, I am eternally in your debt. You I do, Mr. Mason, I do. Begin you take to care now. repay the debt. And you too, sir. Okay. Checking this equipment, if only my hands weren't shaking quite so much. First I was scared of the wolves, and now it's hydrophobia. I've got hydrophobia phobia. My hat. Oh, there isn't anything we could have done differently, I guess. Mason survives a scare while trying to take a picture of some wolves. Perhaps a wildlife photographer needs steadier nerves. I'll be some time working on the mechanism. Good day to you, sir, and Godspeed. So, you think that photograph will come out? I can't say with certainty, but I'm hopeful, sir. I'm due some good luck, no? <laughs> Carry on like this, I'm not sure you are. Yeah. Oh, come on. Juniper and boiled Satan, you scared me. I scared myself as well. Boiled Satan? Yeah, I get that a lot. So, what's that you got there? I need you that. Ain't interested in no scrap paper? It's nothing. Just something for wiping and. Is that the outer half of the night? map? Yeah. Well. Hey, why the hurry, partner? I got a hot tail. Don't you follow me now. This is as nice as I'm gonna ask. Hand it over. Now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ain't no need for that, friend. Oh, no, you don't. I'm gonna let you live, but I really need that map. I'm sorry, dude. Good day for you, mister. Come on now. You gotta cut me loose. I'm gonna cut you loose, but first I gotta take your this map. This is uh, very kind of you. Come on, you <laughs> got your map. You'll be rich from it. Enough for a, a whole night with your favorite style. Think about it. Now, let me go. Let me a waterfall. Go. I see. Hey, and like hey, right next to the waterfall. Like this. No, I'm gonna cut you. Free. There you go. Bye bye. Don't you dare start shit. Sorry, man. I just really had to do this. It's nothing personal. Okay, then, girl. Is that a waterfall? I don't even remember exactly yep. where that was, but I have a feeling that we've already been there. Oh, don't start. Don't start, horse. No, no. You're fine. <laughs> I'm currently on the way to the chopper because we've got some some pelts I really need to sell. Wait. Don't you ever try that? Ain't no one will cry by 
shoot you dead. What? All right, easy now. What did I do? Keep that up. See what happens. Bitch. Okay, dude. Okay. Yeah. Oh, we gotta get up here. I see. So we get some pelts that I really want to sell. Because we've had them for a very long time. And anytime something happens to my horse, the pelt, the bison pelt, falls down. Um... Right, we gotta get the horse right next to him. Welcome back, sir. So, what do you have for me? Hello. Sell. All right, let's have a look. Good opossum pelt. Or rabbit pelt? Well, I can take it, I suppose. Poor bison pelt. Poor wolf pelt. Four times. Damn, we just... Can be sold, but what else can we do with that? A poor songbird carcass. There you go. Enjoy. Scent glands. Oh, we get the scent glands from every the beaver. Every one of my garments is a little different. Because every pelt is a little different. You'll find them nowhere else. Thanks there for your we help. Go. Strawberry. There we are. Ugh. I really don't want to yep. go ahead and free Micah. So I think we should just go and explore the town before we do anything like that. I can't Good morning, mister. buy any. Morning, Oh, but I, what I wanted to do was, um... Welcome. Hello. Send mail. As long as you can cover postage. Yes, it's... We'll zero dollars. We'll post this with the next courier. Nice. You have mailed at least one dinosaur bone location to Deborah McGinnis. Return to any post office after at least 24 hours for your reward. Nice. Yay. Nice. Welcome, welcome. Wow. That looks like a thousand times better than in Valentine. A bath. Let's. Can you arrange a bath? I need a wash. <laughs> All right, head on over when you're ready. Services menu. I see. Wow. So, I think this is our room. R3 needs a bath. I'm not trying to see any of that. Is what I would say if I was... Lying. <sighs> okay, r is clean. Oh, a cigarette card? No way. Thanks. You look fine up. Feeling fresh, I hope? Yeah. Whoa. That is so cool. I wonder what's back there. Okay. Get to stay another night? Nope, I'm not staying another night. Thank you. I think we gotta go and save our dear friend Micah from jail. How did they not hang him yet? Like, I'm sorry, but it's been like 20 days since Lenny came running and was like, they were gonna hang him. 
So did they hang him? Yeah. Blessed Hello, are sir. the meat. I've, uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang, Como Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mix, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. Thank you, Sheriff. So they still want to hang him. Interesting. Let me out of here, you maggots! Oh, brother. Arthur! Arthur! Oh, <laughs> fuck. Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you going to get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, Give me a good reason. Cowpoke. I heard Cowpoke. so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. Amen. Now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Well, you gotta do something. Why? <laughs> I've always looked up to you, Arthur. Wow. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people. Yeah. Want to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. This wall just needs some good forcing. Find a way to free Micah. Steam donkey? Yes. Hook that over the bars. Oh, see oh, if oh. you can pull them off. This thing? What a modern disaster this is gonna be. Oh Just shit. Pull that lever. Come on. This is not gonna go well. Like at all. Game with Micah. Oh. Why would they have this thing right next to that? Seems to be kind of productive. <laughs> Everyone knows Come what on. just happened. What the hell are you doing? He wasn't My God. Oh shit. Oh. Shoot them! Ugh, this is going to get so messy. Oh, not the sheriff! Get it good. You're going to regret 
Can't see anyone. I almost see him. Okay. Stop moving. Micah's body. That's a bit impressive, not gonna lie. What do you mean, dude? I'm just not trying to die. looking so good right now, I'm sorry. <laughs> Is this even my horse? We got out of here, Morgan. My girl? How big is the bunny gonna be? Well, you're riding right into them! Fucking hell, Micah! Do you want this to happen? Do you want the bounty to be like a thousand dollars? Oh! He's a good shot, actually. But that's like the only good thing about Micah. I want to cry. Wait. What the hell was that you pulled back there? I fucking Gotta hate this guy. Wow. Right. Making a house call in the middle of all that? Ain't much I care about more than those guns. That much is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. I saw how it goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny, too. If he hadn't found us in time. Yes, you will all be thanked profusely, I promise. Yeah, well, you're lucky Dutch has got your back. Some reason. Holy shit. Old. I think we finally lost him. I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. My way of saying thank you. And thank you. 
There a holster. I was having a dull day only for you to liven it up by letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Well, Real you might funny. Go. Why you Fucking act all sour all the time. Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court jester? Right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you and me. Sons of Dutch makes us brothers. Uh -huh. Sometimes brothers make mistakes. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back a strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. You ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. <laughs> I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <clears throat> Bye now. Hopefully yeah. it's not gonna happen anytime soon. All right, partners, I'm gonna be stopping this episode here. I'm not sure how long this part is going to be because I feel like I did do a lot today in terms of main story stuff but i was also writing a lot and just exploring the world and i'm pretty sure i'm just gonna cut a lot of that the mission with hosea we did at the beginning was so much fun i am glad we went at night because i'm sure if we went just right ahead they would have been awake and it would have been probably way harder i do not know how to feel about micah's mission i thought i was just gonna attempt to free him and we were just going to go back to camp and everything was gonna be fine but he ended up just shooting up the entire town of strawberry and now everyone there hates me there but yeah i already cannot wait to continue playing i honestly don't know what exactly we'll be doing in the next episode but i feel like this is the magic of this game i did see a new main story mission pop up on the map from somebody i'm not sure who that was but maybe we'll be doing that in the next episode but until then thank you guys so so much for watching and as always i will see you in my next one Bye, guys.